Hey, I'm Satorio Phil. Welcome back to my channel. This is a follow-up video of my spring-summer 2018 unboxing. This is from the Louis Vuitton men's runway show. This is the small pouch and it's in the monogram outdoor. I already did an unboxing of this so if you want to check that out I'll add a card to the top of this video and I'll put the link in the description as well. I'm not going to go into too much details in this bag but what I'm going to show you in this video is more or less what fits inside and what I would probably carry. And then in the second part of this video, I'm going to show you different outfits that I'm going to pair this with. So first of all, I always like to use an iPad as a comparison. Although this is an iPad mini, not the full-size iPad. Just to show you, it actually fits in the front pocket from, from bottom to top. So it actually fits snugly. So if you want to carry it for that, that would be perfect. You can obviously put it in the main compartment as well. What I would probably be using the front pouch for though is my iPhone. So this is an iPhone 10, And if you put it vertically, it will peek through, which I mean is okay if you're just carrying out, but it's probably gonna fall to its side anyway. And of course it's gonna fit inside here since it's smaller than an iPad mini. As for the inside, what I would put inside here is my keys. And of course they would fit inside, no problem. I might put some lip balm, especially if it's cold or dry out. And it's not truly gusset on the bottom, you can kind of see it's starting to bulge out a little bit. So that's the bottom so far, but luckily they did put some extra fabric here. You can see this side's bigger than this one because this is the main body. So that definitely helps keep the top flat. In my last video I talked about if this was just sewn in, like a lot of those zip flat pouches, the top part would probably be looking like this by now. It would be distorted due to the thick objects inside. So now that I have my sunglasses inside in the case, I can put probably put my keys on top. And I'll probably put my wallet. Right now I'm still using the card case. I do have a few others. I have two pocket organizers, but I still like using this. So this is my Damier Graffiti card case. Because this middle compartment does have a magnetic closure, I'll probably put it in here. If I'm not if if they aren't in my jacket or my pant pocket, I'm probably gonna put it in here because there's just some added security. And this is honestly probably the most I would ever carry in this bag. It's really not meant to store everything. It's, I mean, it's titled a small pouch. But this is still pretty, this is a good amount. And I'm gonna be using my phone in and out. I can keep some other stuff in here as well. Like if I have any tickets or cards, I can put them in here for quick access. If I pour this out, I don't think the magnet is going to be strong enough. That's something you want to be careful with this bag. If you set it down because it's not flat on the bottom, you're going to want to make sure your items don't fall out. So if I slowly tilt it, actually it's fine. So it, my phone fell out because it was in the front pocket, but the middle compartment actually stayed. I think if you jiggle it a little bit, it can easily fall apart. I was carrying this bag these were the items I had inside of it I'd have my phone which probably might be in my pant pocket but if I need a quick access I might just put it in here I have a sunglass case this is the usual one I wear the Dior Ohm with the sunglasses inside but if I'm wearing the sunglasses, I'll probably put stuff like my lip balm in here and maybe eye drops. And then I have my card wallet and my keys. Some other alternates that would still fit inside is a Louis Vuitton sunglass case, which is a lot bigger than the Dior own one, but it will fit in the front. It just sticks out a little bit. And again, if you're wearing the sunglasses, I definitely like 
using the case to store some other stuff while the sunglasses are outside. And this is a Louis Vuitton long wallet that still haven't been used. Might have even been discontinued by now. Anything that's smaller than an iPad would fit, but this is thicker. It still has no issue fitting in the front or in the center compartment. This is a full zip wallet. This is actually from Bottega Veneta. This was one of their limited edition or the runway collection. The Buffalo, I think this was maybe three years ago. This is in like an aubergine color and it has that metal detail that was used in their Buffalo leather goods. And this will actually fit in the front punch, front pouch as well. This is size kind of like a zippy wallet. So it's like that. And obviously it'll fit in the middle as well. However, the problem here is that the magnet doesn't work at nearly as well, but actually it still closes. So even with that full zip wallet, the magnet will still close. I think Louis Vuitton probably figured out a size that will work with their item. So I would think the zippy wallet, you can actually use that with this. Now I'm going to show you some outfits that I pair this small pouch with.
Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more videos and check me out on Instagram for the latest updates and exclusive content. And I hope to see you in my next video.